What's going on guys? We are back once again and we are going to be discussing Scooby-Doo Mecha Mutt Menace. So again, this is another little short mini episode movie, whatever you want to call it. Um, went ahead and watched this. Again, you can watch this on Max right now. You guys can watch this, I believe, on Boomerang and also on Prime Video. Now again, this is less than 30 minutes. It's not very long. So it's a very straight story about the gang going uh, after Fred gets into a... Uh, contest of trying to win different traps or different type of science experiments and then they come across this new uh, artificially built uh, machine called Mecho Mutt that's apparently going to be in our space soon but then it just goes wild when the scientist has no reason of why this uh, machine is going insane so it's up to the game to figure out exactly what's going on and after investigating different people and trying to figure out what's going on and of course Shaggy and Scooby you know battling it at the very end due to you know getting in another type of mecha mutt that's when they finally realized it was actually the daughter of the scientist that uh, she again you know he's always obsessed with his work and again not her getting attention or not getting any kind of uh, recognition for how smart she is and again it wasn't that bad of a little mini movie it really wasn't it was just some of the stuff again you know fred being obsessed with traps and all this other kind of stuff and some would say oh that's part of his character which i get but i just wish they would just back off on it just a little bit um <clears throat> other than that didn't really have too much of this uh, of an issue with this film. I think the animation was very well done. I think it was just a straightforward story. And I think it was a lot of fun. I mean, I think that the comedy hit when it was supposed to hit. I think that the drama was there when it needed it. Same thing with the action and adventure. Same thing you get in a Scooby-Doo movie, in a Scooby-Doo everything. Um, just, I think everything was very well done. Uh, if you guys have not seen this, I do highly recommend it. But at the same time, I think that if you are just a big Scooby-Doo fan, then more than likely watch this if you haven't. Um, I haven't watched a good majority of these movies, these little shorts. But again, that's why I'm doing these reviews because I've been watching them. Some I have enjoyed, some I have not enjoyed. Um, again, more the majority of the time, it's most of the actors that we know and love that are playing these characters. Sometimes it is, sometimes it's not. But a lot of times with these movies, it's going to be a hit or a miss. But... Either way, what do you guys think about this? Um, I'm trying to see when when this come out again. It came out probably in the early 2000s, I believe. Yeah, it was 2013 when this came out, so it wasn't. It's not that old. Um, but what do you guys think about this? Have you guys seen this? Is it a good one? Is it a bad one? Um, let me know what you guys think about it down in the comments. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you as always on the next one.